Here's my homeschool haul this week. Hi everyone, I'm so excited to share with you this haul because it has a lot of fun things in it for our homeschool. First, we have this Finding Dory sticker activity fun kit. My mom got this for my son and it includes stickers and uh, I think this is a nameplate, name tag. I'm not sure there are several in the box. Two. Oh, it's just one. It's just one piece, and it's thick. It's made of cardboard. And then here are crayons and the pen. And then here's the activity pad. I don't know if there's uh, there's a tape here, and I don't know if we will use this for our homeschool activities or we will bring this when we travel but it's kind of big to bring with us when we travel so I think we will we will do this here and then the next one is I got this treasured values these are sequencing puzzles the uh, good thing about it is that aside from teaching sequencing it also has values or good traits good behavior that will reinforce my son's behavior so i'm excited to do this with him he also needs work with his sequencing and then my mom got this for him my mom my mom is a powerful force in our homeschooling because she buys us a ton of activities and books and stuff that we use so we are really thankful and grateful to her. She is our main sponsor here. So she got this Imagination Creations Play-Doh set. Um, this is a cake decorating set or a cupcake decorating set. This is the extruder and it comes with different dips. And then it also comes with one dough. Um, this is the newest release from imagination creation in our toys r us it's only 300 pesos so the, there are different variants there's like a there's a waffle waffle making kit and i can't remember the others but there are others i think there are at least four four variants so these are, will be great for stocking stuffers or for your easter basket I think I'll probably get some for my godchildren for their Easter basket. And then the next one is the next ones are books. Here are a few books that we got that have been delivered this week. I ordered them on online. This is I am kind. I don't hit. My son has I have a hitting problem with my son. He saw his older classmates in Sunday, Sunday school hitting, so he's imitating them and he, he thinks it's a fun way to communicate. So we are trying to we are trying to eliminate hitting his hitting behavior. We are trying to stop him from hitting his classmates. And this is a really helpful book. When before we went to school last Saturday, we read this book and then I reinforced the the rules, our classroom rules, and then he didn't he did not hit. I have no idea why he hits in school. That's the only place where he hits. He doesn't hit in other places. He doesn't hit the children in other places. But it seems that he's very fond of his classmates. That's why he is he doesn't hit hard. It's just more of a tap like that on the top of the head or on the arm or on the body but still hitting is not good so this book is really great if you have a problem with hitting with your child i recommend this book and also this one because it also 
covers hitting and it covers sharing and saying sorry and those kinds of things those kinds of attitudes and behaviors that little kids should have like being kind and being generous and then we also the curious george goes to a chocolate factory book also arrived in the mail my son is super super excited about this book he was the one who requested this book i have a list of books which he chooses from and this is another curious george book that he chose curious george says thank you and we haven't read this yet and we haven't read this yet but we've already read this we are going to do this to read them this week and this one is a really good book it's the very hungry caterpillar of course you're all very familiar with it and what's good about this book is that it has stickers and my son loves sticker books and my son loves the the very hungry caterpillar so this is just perfect for us we already have the very hungry caterpillar in board book form it's a secondhand book that i got i think last year from a secondhand bookstore but this was on sale i think i got this for only two or three dollars and yeah this is really great we already did the first first few pages so after the all the stickers have been used up then we will have a book to enjoy and then this mix it up book i'm pretty i'm sure if you have the press here book you'll be familiar with this this is also a second-hand book that I got. I think I wasn't able to show this to you in my last haul, so, but we got this last week. It's just mixing colors, and my son really loves this kind of interactive book. And then I also got this Finding Dory sticker scenes book, and it has it has a story stories in it I'm not sure oh I think it it has the movie story in it so this will be great for our brain breaks and then what else? I got him this Japanese food set we are going to use this in our dramatic play my son loves pretending to be a chef so I'm trying to look for these kinds of these kinds of play food for him. He also likes pretending to be a sushi chef, a dim sum set, chef. Sometimes he says he's a baker, so this will be great for us. And then my mom got this Barbie cupcake set. I understand that this is Barbie and I have a son but we also have I also have a niece who comes regularly for playtime and all I can offer her are my son's toys so I decided that this will be great for us three to play with and for if it's just my son and I I'm not sure if I want to remove the stickers on the sets or if i have to or they come separately i don't know i haven't opened this yet uh let's open this in a while and also i try to keep an open mind with my son especially with his toys some parents don't like here some parents here that i know don't like to give girl toys quote unquote girl toys to their sons and then boy toys to their girls but when I was a kid, I liked playing with cars and trucks and robots and I only played with Barbie when I was older because the other the children in my neighborhood wouldn't play with me anymore because all I had were cars and and robots and I only had the boys to play with. It it's not like for one gender only and drinking tea is for everybody. So I think and the color pink isn't just for girls a lot of guys wear pink tough guys wear pink <laughs> so 
I try to keep an open mind with his, with our toys. And then mom also got this one, or I think I got this one. Yeah, I got this one. This is another break time set. It comes with cupcakes and these two coffee, coffee cups. So this will be great for our coffee shop dramatic day. I have a supermarket set which I'll show you. I want to cover the grocery parts and then I don't know if I'll just cover them a plain white or I'll print some coffee shop signs and pictures. I don't know yet but we'll, pr we'll definitely use that. And then my husband and I can order from my son. So let's open this. This is the cupcake set. Love that it comes in a box, like the Lego boxes. But this one is also cardboard. Oh, the stickers are already on the plates and the stuff. Here are the contents. Oh! See, it comes with more stickers so I think I will just leave the leave these out I'll just give these to my niece so I won't stick them anymore into the cups so here are the cups two cups and then the plates these plates come with the stickers already and these also comes with more plates for the teacups and the Cupcakes. Love that these can be removed. Love it. So we have two cupcakes and two mini pies or tarts. And then we have four spoons. And then, oh, we don't have sugar. Cover. I don't know where this cover is supposed to go. Oh, I see. Oh no. So that's how it looks. And then let's check out the other side. Let's check out this. Side. This is the coffee shop set. By the way, we got these sets both on sale. This one originally cost 500 pesos. I got this for only 350. And the cupcake set originally cost. 500 and I think we got it at 20% off so it might seem that we are always hauling but I rarely pay full price for the things that I buy even the books were on sale oh this set is cute it, it comes with a set for Barbie there we go here are the two plates for the oh don't you just love that cupcake the cupcakes and look at that it's so pretty and then these are for Barbie Barbie's mini cupcake and her coffee to go then the stairs we have two and then this is the coffee cup and this is the tray love that it comes with a tray so I think I will just put them inside the cupcake box because it still has a lot of space in it and then I'll just chuck the this box I don't like keeping the boxes the toy boxes I usually transfer them to ziploc bags or if I already have a same theme themed toy set or set like this one then I'll just consolidate all of them together that's a great organizing tip for any mom who, who homeschools and who has a ton of toys and books and homeschooling aids like us so that's it for this week's homeschool haul please don't forget to give us a thumbs up and to subscribe bye